everybody, welcome back to my channel and this is me again, your teacher Russell. In this video, I'm gonna teach you the difference between fun and funny. Well, I'm actually teaching Korean students and I've been doing this job for about 14 years now and I actually noticed that most of them are still having some errors in the usage of the words fun and funny. So they are sometimes confused in which situation they are going to use. And if you're having the same kind of problem, this lesson is the best lesson for you. So let's go ahead and start this lesson right away. So let's start with fun. Sentence number one. I brought my dog to the park today. She had fun playing with other dogs. My dog had fun. It's because she was able to mingle with other dogs. And she had fun. She had fun playing with other dogs. Example number two, I went to Korea last year. I had fun meeting my students, my cousins, and my friend. Fun. I enjoyed having a conversation with them. I enjoyed going to a lot of different places with them. I had fun. I had fun. Another example, my son played basketball with his friends. He had fun playing the game with them. Fun. He had fun. He had fun playing the game. He had fun interacting with his friends. He had fun talking with his friends. Fun. Another example, I attended a reunion with my friends in high school. We talked about our high school life and it was so much fun. Fun. I had so much fun talking with my high school friends. Fun. Last example. I love going to the grocery store. Buying something for my family is so much fun for me. Fun. I am enjoying going to the grocery store. I am enjoying buying some things that my family needs. So for me, it is fun. It is fun going to the grocery store because I enjoy doing it. Fun. 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 Now let's move on to funny. So now, again, I'm going to give you five examples of sentences where you can identify the meaning of the word funny. First example, my son and I watched a TV show about Mr. Bean. As you know, Mr. Bean is a very hilarious guy. He does a lot of things that makes us laugh. So, when we are watching Mr. Bean, it makes us laugh. So, that's why we can use funny. My son and I watched a TV show about Mr. Bean. It was really funny. We laughed so hard. Funny. Mr. Bean is a funny person. Mr. Bean does a lot of funny things that makes people laugh. Funny. Example number two. I actually asked permission from my husband and my son if I can say this example, but yes, they agreed. Number two, my son and my husband loves to fart. It is very funny to me. Funny because it makes me laugh so hard when they do fart. Farting is very funny for me. It makes me laugh so hard. Funny. Example number three, have you seen the movie The Three Idiots? Well, this movie is an Indian movie. And if you haven't seen it yet, you should watch it because it's really funny. It is funny, but you can also learn a lot of lesson. So you guys should see it. This movie is very funny. It will make you laugh very hard. Try it. That's the third example. Example number four. Yesterday, I was talking to my student, Lynn. And Lynn told me a lot of funny things about her classmates. She said she laughed so hard because her classmate is telling her a lot of jokes. So Lynn was laughing, so it makes her friend a funny friend. Funny. Okay, so for the last example, let's talk about clowns. As you know, clowns are funny, right? Not just funny, but they are very funny. They love doing a lot of funny tricks and makes people laugh. So yes, clowns are very funny because again, they make us laugh. Funny. Now, it's your turn to tell me about the difference between fun and funny. I will give you five minutes 
to write your answers in the comment section and tell me an example of a sentence or a situation where you think something is fun and funny. I promise to check your sentences and I will tell you if it's right or wrong. So that's it! If you are new to my channel, please don't forget to click that subscribe button and notification bell so you will be updated by my new uploads. And take note that I upload videos every Sunday that is 8pm Philippine local time. So again, thanks for having this class with me today. I hope that you really learned a lot of things from me. Thanks a lot for your time. You have a great day!